So when we're working on our single leg balance, we can do a little bit of what we call like a, kind of like the flamingo position with our legs and a point as we're out working the single leg. So when we're doing this, we can always give ourselves a little bit of finger support. As you start with fingertips, because you can't do too much weight on it. If you have a cushion surface, make sure you're not making too much of an indentation. And we can also take away one fingertip at a time as we get better at it. So we give a nice little, uh, little crutch train as if you need it and take it away as we need to. So as always, we pay attention to the tripod, uh, the tripod, even pressure heel, big toe, little toe. So as we get into our, so basically what we're going to think about is we're going to do just like a slight weight shift on, so say if I want to balance my left leg, we have a little shift on the left side just so I can keep a, um, like a nice box in the spine so it's a parallel pelvis and uh, rib cage. And I'm going to be able to hook this foot around behind and maintain that tripod as I kind of take a little bit of a lingo stance. From here I can almost do like a little hook around here and almost be like a bilateral outward wind or external rotation of the legs. Go back to the other side, maintain my tripod, hook around, everything nice and even. Spinal box is intact, parallel through here, not getting too much of a side shift. I can think of almost like a slight outward wind, like almost a slight pickup of the arch to get those outward spirals going. A little side shot. So I can get a little drift here. I can have a couple fingertips if I need it. I can get into the position with my fingertips, then try and just maintain slight outward push. Take away fingertips one at a time until I can maintain the position. Hold that for five seconds, uh, five seconds, 10 seconds, build up to 20 or 30. And just drift her to the other side. See if I can take away and just kind of bounce back and forth. You can do that for several minutes or you know three or four reps on each side for as long as you can uh, maintain a hold. So, anyways, that's uh, the basics of the flamingo maneuver. Um, it's just kind of over under the one foot, back across, get that little extra external rotation from um, fingertips if you need it, and then we'll build into some of the other um, um, single leg stance balance progressions.